Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock, and welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Pre-Funnel Grab by Nintendo Work, and I messed the recording up, um, so I didn't record the actual blind run, so I'm actually going to play it once again just for the video. Um, that's why there is an already a thumbs up there. If you're new to the channel, though, guys, please like and subscribe, but without further ado, let's jump into the description. A sequel to the old Pre-Funnel, but I think easier. Special thanks to Aaron for playtesting, and notes on this one were just that it's easy. All right, let's jump into the map, shall we? I'll try and kind of like blunder through the way I actually did it in the Brian run. Um, it did only take me like a couple of moments, a couple of minutes to actually solve, because um, yeah, clearly it is actually that easy. Um, and what I will say is what I said originally, I was playing Half-Life 2 recently, and these, these, just like the white lights, remind me of the lights in the Citadel, not with like the outsiding bits. I always like the irks, like I like this light style. It's very, very nice indeed. All right, so we came in here, and we fumbled around a bit. We pressed the button, which didn't do anything for a start because um, there's a long delay on the button for some reason. So, uh, yeah, we, we came in here and we spawned this and we popped it on here. I kind of walked through here and thought, okay, well, what are we going to do here? We'll do that and that. We admired Irk's sort of portrait style um, logo there that he's now come accustomed to seeing in his maps. Um, but then we was like, hmm, okay, so what are we going to do? So we came over here. Uh, I thought, hmm, maybe we can jump into the funnel. I just realised, no, clearly, we, we can't jump in the funnel. It's too far away, too far away. Um, so yeah, then we were thinking, well, okay, it's really not that difficult, surely. We must be overcomplicating things. Uh, so then I thought, well, okay, the cube doesn't have to be on the button. So what we can do is something like this. And we'll put the cube in the funnel. We'll bring the cube through to the other side. Like so. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Okay, that, that didn't happen the first time. I actually hit this first time. The, when my original blind run. That's just going to fall back into the funnel, isn't it? If I'm not careful. Alright, so that drops down there. And the rest is pretty much plain sailing. We should stand on the cube, jump up here, bring the cube with us. And we're done. So while we're flying through the funnel, we just get to admire some of the scenery. Um, no real Easter eggs in this one. Uh, there's a nice little panel broken off, exposing the wires in the in the back panels well there. Done. I didn't notice this light. This light is very nice as well. I'm going to note this on your file. Uh, I don't know if that's like a normal thing I have ignored before, or if that's just like an Irk instance that he's created himself. But yeah, nice light on the um, on the button. I never actually checked. Is there one on this one as well? hard to tell because there is no cube there. Uh, yeah, there is. Look at that. Nice light. I like that. Be gone. Be gone, evil companion cube. Uh, anywho, yeah, there's the map. Thank you very much for making it. Very good indeed. Um, I made the comment that um, these small maps for like an experience, hammer map I like you, um, Probably don't take you very long, but it's always nice to um, you know have some new puzzles. I know you're working still hard on, on DA and stuff, so yeah. Thanks a lot for the map, uh, guys. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match to pay, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link to that is in the description. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. Happy gaming.